What's going on YouTube? Kyle Ken coming at you with some more Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 2. Alright, in the last part, I believe we found out that the next target of Gospel is Electopia, so we're on our way now to... Dad's Lab? I don't remember if there's something else I wanted to do first. Uh, oh, I think I wanted to see if I can face Total Mini version 2. Uh, I'm not sure if we can yet. Uh, sure. Okay, we can, and we can battle Total Mini version 2. That was a terrible idea. Why did you let me do that? You, you guys are supposed to tell me not to do this stuff. <sighs> anyway, uh, obviously stronger, faster. Uh, yeah, oh, damn it. I am not going to win this, but I'm going to get deleted. Uh, I don't want to get deleted. Uh, hey, man, uh, I have a few wide swords in, so I can spare that one. Well, this battle is not going my way already. Because I have to keep fucking adding chips because I have a fucking alphabet soup for a folder. And I just got comboed, kind of. I don't know why she just did that now. Or he, because Toadman's he, I think. Toadman, derp. Uh, I'd rather do Omega Cannon. Uh, so, I guess only for that. I hit him for 100. Uh, attack plus 10, so that's always good. Uh, it's not really for much for me to talk, damn it. It's for me to talk about right now. Uh, great, now I need L. I mean, wide sword. Uh, here you grab, please don't. Hello? D damn it! Oh my god, Lord. I'm gonna get destroyed. Yes! My favorite program advanced! We're at one of them. Yeah, sword, wide sword, and long sword. Life sword, let's go! Uh, it pretty much cuts a 3 by 2 area. So if you have an area grab, you won't miss with life sword. Oh my lord. I am not gonna lose to you, Toad Man. I am going to... A, B, C, D, E. Yes! Omega Cannon! A 10 second invisible cannon. And for some reason, hits more than one with one shot. I don't know why. But I'm gonna get Toad Man version 1. And, uh, yeah. So we got Toad Man version 1. I usually don't use him because he just uses this song thing. Uh, but now, let's see if there's any more jobs we can take care of. Uh, need a Cupid. Alright, this is the job I told you about that uh, pays uh, about 10,000 zennies. So, I will have to meet uh, in here in Marine Harbor, and it's really not that hard of a job, it's really easy. Wait, no. He's in Okaden. I wasn't really reading. I think. Uh, I probably should have read. I'm pretty sure it's in Okaden. I know the job, uh, part of the job is in Marine Harbor though, that's probably why I got slightly confused on that. Anyway, so it's this guy right here. Oh, are you my Cupid? Yes, I wrote the request. I never thought I would fall in love at this age, but love comes and goes as it wills. The moment I met her, an electric shock hit me. I thought my heart was going to stop. She has a lovely smile. She is my sunshine. I want to tell her how I feel, but I'm too shy. I can't speak when she is near. Do you know how I can tell her? Just go and do it. If I could, I'd not be here right now. And if I tried, my heart would stop. Please help me. Please. Out of this jam. Hey, Lan, how about a love letter? It's a time-honored way of confessing one's love, right? Good thinking, we'll do it. Write her a love letter, mister. A love letter. That could work. Yes, that's it. I'll do it now, but what should I write about? That's easy. Write about your passion for her. Just writing it won't make you tense up, will it? Yes, you're right. All right, then. Here I go. Oh, come on. Let's go. I, I did it. It's the best thing I've ever written. Now, here's my request, son. I want you to take this letter to my darling, and after she reads it, bring me her reply. I don't know where she is now, but she likes flowers very much. She'll be where flowers bloom. Her nickname is Sunflower. My life is depending on you. Don't let me down. I'm counting on you. Oh, wow, that was a lot to say for I'm counting on you. Could have just passed me the letter and said pass me the reply. But no, he extended everything. Anyway, so just going to go back to Marine Harbor real quick. And she is right meow. You're looking for a sunflower? That'd be me. What do you want? Huh? A love letter. Or a letter. Uh, let's have a look. 
Please don't read it out in front of me. I really don't want to have to read that. Why, this is a love letter. I never thought I'd get one at my age. And with words of such passion that I'm melting. Some great man must have sent me this. I feel passion that I'd, that I'd all but forgotten. My answer? Oh, don't rush me. A bad man couldn't write it, surely. Son, tell the sender of this letter. Start as a friend. I'm counting on you. So now we have to go back and tell the guy her reply, and uh, that'll be it for the side quest. Uh, open pass. I'm not really cutting this out because it takes like two seconds to get there. Uh, so what does she say? Start as friends? Yahoo! This is the best day of my life. You saved me. Thank you, thank you. I can die happy now. Before I forget, here's your reward. This is for you. 10,000 zenny. That's free money right there. Yes, now I'm at 36,000. Hello, when did I get that? Oh, I guess I kept finding it last episode. No, oh yeah, and I went to, uh, I went to Yumlin with about 10,000, so alright, I guess it sort of adds up. Anyway, let's go do more requests. Well, there's one right, I don't think we can complete right now. Or at least I can at the moment. Uh, paying in advance. I'll pay in advance with an item you won't get elsewhere. The job is easy and the world is great. Act now. If you're interested in hurry over the Yumlin area, one of my black navy is waiting for you there. So, we're going to take on this quest. It obviously sounds kind of fishy, but it doesn't matter. We're going to go anyway. Uh, I guess I'll just meet you over in Yumlin 1. So, uh, I guess I'll meet you there. Alright, so, we're in Yumlin 1, and what we need to do is we need to get over to the entrance of Yumlin area 2. So, I'm just going to come around this way and go on the warp. And here's the requester. Has the city net battler arrived? Oh, would you happen to be the net battler? Yes! Thank you for your time. Please take this. If it's okay, I'll pay you up front. Gatekeep B. The city net battlers always take care of me. They lower their guard as soon as they get their pay as soon as they get paid. They're so easy to take. Heh <laughs> heh Here's my request. Leave all your battle chips now. City net battlers are such easy marks. I make fake requests to city net battlers, then I steal their chips and sell them on a black market. It's so profitable. I don't, don't want to give up. I'll make you. Take this. So, we get a pretty good item, but we just have to beat this guy's ass, so... Actually, uh... I'm, not, I'm probably not going to use gut shot this battle, and before I get both guts man and dash attack in the next hand. Alright, so this battle is going to be relatively easy. I don't think these uh, these flamies move at all. Also, you can't uh, use guard to hit the uh, satellite. I think it's called satellite. Uh, sparker. Uh, ooh, okay. Well, there's Gutsman. Uh, so, I'm just going to use Gutsman version 2. Uh, I don't exactly know if I want to go on to those panels yet, because if I get a long sword, I can uh, still hit them. Or if I get, uh, maybe I'll get Life Sword next turn. Uh, oh, whoop, oh, there's Long Sword. Uh, I guess there's that. Alright, so, boom. And, actually, I'm actually gonna stand here. Cause, uh, if I just stand there, I can just hit him with that and kill him. So, that was pretty easy. I wish I got a Satellite G, though, cause we're gonna need those, need one of those soon. So, that's it for that job. We've got a Kate Gate Key B. Uh,. I'm pretty sure that we we can use it now, but I'll show you how to use that later once I go back to Land's house. Uh, all right, let's see what do you, what do you need. Our water heater program is busted. We've got no hot water. Do you have lots of chips? Can you give me a fire sword F? Of course, I'll give you a slash or L in return. I'm in the uh, lobby of a sun. So look for me there. First person uh, gets a job. Uh, no, damn it, no. Uh, hold on, because I don't know if I have a fire sword F. Pretty sure I don't right now. Uh, code. No, I have Fire Blade. R. Alright, so I'm not going to take on that quest right now. Uh, and I don't really remember where to find the virus that gave you Fire Sword. So after I find those, I'll, uh... That's when I'll go do that quest. But until then, actually, might be in Kodo area, but I don't remember. Anyway, once you get up here, you get in Dad's lab. Uh, first... Wait, is there anything in here? Only roast him over. Alright, so you want to come over here, into Dad's lab suit. And we get a power up. Very nice. Uh, use that on Mega Man. Uh, I'm gonna go attack now because, like I said, I do charge, attack, then rapid. Uh, I think we can. 
Can we jack in over here? No, not yet. Oh, no, not at all. Here's one of the retro traders if you want to use that. Uh, I want to come over here first, or next rather, and jack into the monitor comp. Um, I think that there's a virus you can only find up here in the monitor comp. I don't remember what it's called, but it makes a balloon of a certain element, and well, it'd be easier to. It'll be easier once you see it, as opposed to me explaining it in the middle. I think it's in this comp, Shrimpy. No. It might not be in this comp, it might be in the other comp that Dad's in front of. Or Lamb's Dad is in front of. Uh. Okay, money? Oh, Aqua plus 40. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, I'll well, just jack out. And now, before we talk to Lamb's Dad, we're gonna try to jack into the computer he's in front of if we can. Alright, just jack in here, and then after that we'll talk to Lamb's dad. Okay, so let's see what we got in here. Uh, what do we got? Anything? Come on. I know there's something in here. Okay, what do you have for me? A oh, rug up too, I'll take that. Uh, program though, there and I are helping Dr. Hikari. Uh, anything? I don't think there's anything else in here. Hardhead, that's hard too, that's hard to go. I'm not gonna fight you, waste of time. Uh, Alright, nothing else in here. Alright, so let's talk to Dr. Hikari, or also known as Lan's dad. So, dad, trouble's brewing in Yumlands. Lan, how did you know that? A male pen pal of mine uh, was there in Yum Square. So, you know the net nabbit who ruined Yumland and are coming here? Yeah, I wonder if there is anything we can do. Officials are patrolling the net, leave them uh, alone. But I want to be of help somehow. I see. I'm working on a theory right now. I want you to find a program that I need to finish the theory. Where is that program? I don't know. Possibly on the net. I don't know what area it's in. I got it, Dad. I'll go find that program. Glenn, promise me. If you run into those navvies, run away. But with Mega Man's abilities, you probably can't win. But always running is but always running away isn't brave. The program for my research is uh, for upgrading Mega Man's abilities. If we were to complete the program and equip it on Mega Man, he'll be extremely powerful. The program is called a Change Bet. I don't know anything about the program's name. Look on the Square's cyberboard for information. You might find something there. Try going there. I should really go find it, but I'm too busy with work. I understand, Dad. Leave it to us. It's up to you, Lan. Alright, so we have to find an item called the change bat, or uh, ching bang, ching, change battery, damn it. So, uh, he's gonna check this, uh, the derp. The squares on the net, the boards on the net. Uh, I think we actually have to post there. I'm pretty sure. So let's go in here, and I think it's this one? Uh, nope, this is the virus board. You can read about viruses and anything you want in here. Alright, here we go. Uh, let's post a message to collect info. Where? What should we write? How about... I'm looking for a change by info, please. Mega Man, not exe. That'll do. Okay, the message has been posted. All we have to do now is wait for information. How long should we wait? A reply won't come so soon, so impatience leads to a loss. So let's pass time by collecting info in the square. That's a good idea. I actually forgot to show this room off earlier. This is pretty much... Uh, well, you post for, this is this is like the forum room of the Den Square, pretty much. Uh, this one's a chat board. Uh, talk about uh, various things. This one's a virus board. Talk about virus busting and possibly program advances on there. This one's street board. Uh, just stuff that happens on the street or like yeah, pretty much. This is the battle board. Okay, now here's talk about battle codes, uh, trading stuff like that. Uh, yeah. So, uh, we're gonna go around the square and talk to everyone. A good program around here? I don't know. We have to talk to everyone in the square, I believe. Uh, things are quiet today, but I can't lower my guard back to patrol. Uh, a good program, I haven't seen any around here. I don't think anyone in here has any information about it. Probably just across the board. Uh, beautiful town, la la la, la 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 square. Alright, so that's enough time. I think, right? Yeah. So, uh, first I'm gonna buy some more sneak friends, cause I'll be needing them. Because I can only hold four right now, so I have to constantly go back and buy them. So, uh, there should be three new posts. Uh, oh, no, there's two. Uh, this is your first post, right? Introduce yourself first. That's proper netiquette. Hi there. I don't really know much about programs, but I know someone who does. It's a girl. 
She hangs out with a tough boy a lot in ACDC Park. Alright, so based on info, we can figure out that she hangs out in ACDC Park, and she's usually with a tough guy. So, uh, actually, can we battle Game Man version 2? I really don't want to. Okay, good, we can't do it now anyway. Because it's really hard with Alphabet Soup. So, I'm gonna go to ACDC Town and head over to where the park to see if that girl is there. So, let's, what are you creeping on? Well, it's been nice cooling off a bit, that's for sure. Just standing in someone else's house to cool off, that's kind of weird, but whatever. Anyway, talk to this guy. Huh? You mean the girl that hangs out with me? You mean my wife, right? Ah, uh, she's out at the campground. We are newlyweds. But that doesn't stop her from going on her own. Say, you think you could give her this uh, for me? It's uh, it's the battery for her PET. Don't want her to run out of power in the mountains. Thanks a lot, kiddo. Got the battery. Alright, so now we have to go to Oaken and Campground, so I'll meet you over there. Alright, so here in Oaken and Campground, we have to find that guy's wife, and she is right over here. Say, that's my PT's battery. You brought it to me? Huh? You want to ask me a question? What is it? Uh, it changed better, huh? I've heard of it. Now, where was it? I remember. My email friend mentioned a program by that name. Where did we meet? Uh, Tricoto Square. He's there, I think. He has a purple navy. Oh, he also asked me to do something for him. Uh, would you give this to him, too? Uh, got, well, I got no data. Alright, so, before we head over to Kodo Square, on the way here, I think I saw, uh, that guy that is, uh, part of the, uh, chip trading side quest that, uh, you sh that we need to do. Well, you don't have to do it, but I'm probably gonna cover it, uh, this guy. Hey, do you have an Invis 1 Asterisk? If you do, would you trade it for my escape end? I don't think I do. Can't, okay, so I don't have an Invis 1, so I guess from here I'll just cut over to, uh, Kodo Square, so I'll see you. Alright, so this isn't Kodo Square, but I thought I'd show something off real quick. Uh, if you did this hot quest I did and got the gate key B, what you can do is step on one of these wharfs, I don't remember which one it is, and it will take you to one of the one of the four squares in this game. Uh, this is like a little shortcut. I think it's this one. No? How about you? Alright, it's this one. So you step on this one, and we're in Yumlin Square, I think, right? Yeah, we're in Yum Square, so that's a nifty little shortcut there. But uh, this isn't where we want to go. We want to go to Kodo Square, so uh, I'll just meet you over there at Kodo Square from here. All right, so here in Kodo Square, we have to look for a purple navy, and I believe it's this guy right here. I heard the program is in Yum Square. I'm giving you this for bringing me my friend's message, and we get the Yum Key. Uh, we're actually going to need that to get into the area of Yum Square where it's in. So I'm going to jack out walk back to Land's house and jack in there and take the shortcut over to Yum Square. Uh, I guess I'll... no, it won't, it won't take that long since we have the little... we have the shortcut now, so I guess I won't cut it out this time. But sorry about all the cuts I made in this video. Uh, I just thought it would be pretty boring and more time consuming to see me running from place to place uh, repetitively because this is kind of a... This is kind of one of those parts in the game where you have to do a lot of running around. Even though you're going to get something good out of it, it's just kind of tedious. So I'm not even going to waste a sneak run. I'm just going to run up here real quick. And Yum Square. So that's why you should do that one side quest uh, really quick. Uh, is it this way? Yeah, it's this way. Alright, so now we're in Yum Square. So now we have to run all the way back around to that room. And we'll try to pick up the change battery. Uh, with thanks to the help of that key that that Navi just gave us. All right, so then we'll run over here. But I think I'll save that for next episode because we're coming up at about the 20 minute mark now. So you guys know the deal. Comrades, subscribe, and friend, all that good jazz. This is Kyle Ken. Catch you next time. Later.